Hi guys, so today I did a first impressions on this Maybelline the Falsies Mascara and when you get into it you'll see that I did not intend on recording an intro for it. Um, but then I felt like I needed to give you guys more information about the mascara because after I put it on I read the back. I know I probably should have done that beforehand <laughs> but um this mascara actually has um, fibers in it so you know when you see the the first impression I don't really notice that it has fibers in it um, but that may be why the second coat gave me some trouble um, but at any rate um, this is what I did a first impression on and if you'd like to see um, the application and everything of, of these lashes then just keep watching bye guys hey guys so um, the reason why I look pretty weird is because I've not put on my mascara yet and there's a reason for that I want to do a first impressions on um, Maybelline's falsies black drama mascara it's in the color oh, black drama um, my friend Mackenzie gave this to me and she was like, I hope you like it. Let me know how it goes. So we're going to do a first impressions on it. Um, I've been using, uh, this voluminous butterfly by L'Oreal and I really, really like it. It makes my lashes look like they're fake. I, it just makes them look so big and beautiful and I love them. But, um, since this one is actually called the falsies, I'm interested to see if I get a similar effect. So let's bring the mirror close. Let's put it on and see what happens. Okay, so the brush is curved and it does have like a little a little bend to it. Okay, I like that it's not a super wet formula but it's not super dry either like there is that that place in the middle that's important <laughs> not too wet not too dry Okay, so that's pretty much one coat. Um, I definitely see a difference. But I, let's put some on the other eye and then we'll see what two coats does. It does have a tendency to clump because of the, the thickness of it. But it's really easy to take care of those clumps before they dry. Like, it's really easy to just... Go back over it with a brush and, and uh, smooth them out. Okay, so that's, that's all over one coat. Let's add a second coat. I usually add two or three coats on a normal day. Just because I, I, I don't wear fake lashes, they're really hard for me, but uh, I like the look of it. It's a little harder to put the second coat on. It's like it doesn't really want to go over the first coat as well it kind of wants to stick to it so maybe I should have stopped with one coat yeah I think I should have stopped with one coat too late now <laughs> The brush makes it kind of hard to put it on the lower lashes, um, but I think I can fix that with an eyeliner brush. I 
Yeah, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to fix it with an eyeliner brush. Okay, so bottom line, um, this mascara is not a natural look. <laughs> Let me bring you guys closer so you can kind of see. Um, I don't feel like it gives as good of an effect as the L'Oreal Voluminous, Voluminous Butterfly, um, but the effect is good. Um, not natural <laughs> not natural at all so if what you're looking for is kind of a natural thing this is not for you but for the big lash effect works pretty good so all in all i'm gonna call this a win and i'll see you guys later bye